All right, welcome back everybody. It is your boy Crypt here and today KSI just dropped his music video for Summer Is Over. Uh, this reaction might be a little bit different than normal. I saw him tweet about this song a couple days ago, okay? And in this tweet, he talked about how emotional this song was for him, and that he cried while making the song. He's cried since making the song. And coming from an artist myself, making songs that give you this kind of emotion are very, very difficult. It's, it's very hard. And it's even harder to put it out to the public to let them hear the vulnerability that exists within you, especially because people that don't like you tend to weaponize it against you. So it's, it's very hard. And I just want to take this a little more serious give it the attention that it needs and really sit back and listen to what he is saying and why it's evoking this emotion from him. So I'm not going to plug any kind of sponsor in the beginning like I normally would. I'll at least wait till the end. But uh, yeah, let's sit here, listen to what KSI is saying to us with Summer Is Over. Ah. Yeah, I like these harmonies and melodies in the beginning already. Maybe it's the last time Looking for my star sign oh, Everything is tied I don't want to live a lie She's in slow mode How am I supposed to feel right? How am I supposed to get a fun feeling? I see crowds of millions there All fucked up with their hands in the air But they just a party like the summer down end And maybe our love is a demon on chain If it was the same, would you do it all again? I got a couple things I want to talk about. Sorry, I, I don't like stopping songs like this. Uh, I really like the music video so far. This is a very technical music video. I can't tell if it's partially green screened or not, but everybody behind him is in slow-mo. He's in fast mode. The way you do that is you have to film the video at two times speed, and it, it's very difficult. It is a very difficult thing to do, but I can't tell if it's a green screen or not. Regardless, um, I really like that cadence right there. It was a cool, memorable cadence right there, talking about how he sees millions there that are all fucked up with their hands in the air, uh, waiting to party like the summer doesn't end. And then the song is called Summer is Over. So it's talking about things like people are living in a moment that they feel like is never going to end, but then inevitably the summer does end. And I think that's very metaphorical to a relationship that he's talking about in this one right here. Like he's in this relationship like it's never going to end. Um, and then the summer's over, the relationship ends, and he's fucked up like he doesn't know what to do about it. That's what I'm getting from it so far. Yeah, but just a party like the summer down end. And maybe our love is a demon on chain. If it was the same, would you do it all again? How long does the high last, do you know? Mm. Talking about the high last thing, yeah. Sun, 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 sun shine. No summer is over. Cool transition. So I like that line about the, you know, I thought the pressure was supposed to make diamonds. I've heard that before, but it's it's a very true thing. Um, you can just see the somberness on his face. He's doing a good job at, at portraying the emotion that he wants to invoke in everybody right now. Um, yeah, I'm still getting it, that metaphorical vibe, and he's, he's talking more about this relationship. And uh, I can see why it would make him sad to talk about this. Uh, definitely a volatile state of mind. I guess I gotta pay for this one, baby. I been thinking I was better on my own. Made this Do you 
it, see, that's how you know he's dead. That's a delicious looking burger. Dude doesn't even, he just picks it up. He's like, all right, I'm not going to do it. Uh, the whole music video is obviously metaphorical of the summer and like people partying like the summer doesn't end. You got the cookouts, you got the swimming parties, you got the water gun fights, everything that represents a fun summer. But eventually it all comes to an end. And even right here, you can kind of see some of the leaves starting to die. So the summer is literally ending in the video as well. And, um, you know, the good times are ending. And again, a very metaphorical thing with the relationship that he's talking about. And, uh, yeah. Oh, the cookout, the bonfire, the, the marshmallows, the s'mores. Summer is over. Ooh, I'm, I'm loving this melody that I'm hearing in the background, this run that I don't know if he's doing it or somebody else is doing it, but sounds good. No, summer is over. Summer is over. I need you like the moon, 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 moon light. No, summer is over. Beautiful song, beautiful song. Shout out to Troy for directing that. Oh, that's okay. Okay, hold on, Adobe Premiere. All right, shout out to KSI for that one. I can definitely see where the sadness would come in. Um, really cool music video. I, I like the, a lot of the metaphors that I saw in that, and I'm still confused on how it was shot. I, I feel like some of it was green screen because the emo like the motion of his clothes and stuff while he was walking looked normal and supernatural, and whenever you speed it up and slow it down, sometimes that gets taken away, so... I don't know. There could be some really cool effects that were done there. But regardless, it was cool. Metaphorical. I liked it. Uh, how do you guys feel about it, though? That is the more important thing. Shout out to everybody that watched this video. And I uh, appreciate you guys. And also, shout out to everybody on the screen right here. If you guys want to sign up and become a YouTube channel membership supporter, that would be awesome. Uh, because videos like this obviously get copyright claimed and you know, there's nothing we can really do about it So everybody on the screen right here supports me directly through memberships on YouTube You get a cool badge next to your name you get priority comments I got a little tab where I can only see those comments and I always respond to everybody on there And uh, I give away free merch all the time to those people. But yeah, it'd be awesome if anybody wanted to do that I appreciate each and every single one of you guys you guys mean the world to me and uh, again Shout out to KSI for just letting this emotional side show it's a very hard thing to do and I as an artist Talking to another artist, I truly do appreciate it. But yeah, that's the end of this one. Here's the plug. Stop! Before you watch this video, I need at least five of you guys just to use my code CRYP20 at Manscaped and buy literally anything. You get it for 20% off and free worldwide shipping. Why would you not? Buy the anti-chafing boxers that make your dick feel big. I don't think that's part of the product, but coming from a valid user of the product, it certainly does. Buy the ball deodorant. You literally just dab it up on your hands, spread it around on your bad boys, and they smell good all day long. It's anti-chafing, and you don't have to worry about swampy nuts. It's a great birthday gift. Christmas is coming up. Buy it for Halloween. You're going to be walking through a bunch of haunted houses, doing some trick-or-treating. You don't want swampy nuts doing that. And Manscaped fixes that. Plus, it's 20% off and free worldwide shipping with code CRYP20. And anybody that buys literally anything, I'm following them back on my Instagram. Just show me proof that you use my code, and boom. Follow back. Where were you on the nights that I sat by myself? In my room, out my mind, trying to handle my health. All alone on the phone, hoping you pick up the cell. But now I know how it goes when I get your voicemail. Where were you on the nights that I sat by myself? In my 